Wow, how are you doing guys? I see a lot of black and yellow or lime as the, the color is called. We will be talking about how to redefine reliable motion for a better tomorrow. And Innomotics is the company what we will be talking about. You will hear secrets about how to reduce carbon footprint. Well, if that is not something where you want to go and listen to, then I don't know. Please welcome. Give me a big applause helping me here to welcome Michael Reichler. Okay. <laughs> okay. You won, Michael. You won, Sorry definitely. This is an awesome round. Let's take a seat. Did you tell them that they get a bonus if they clap? They don't need bonus. <laughs> they're, okay. they're, they're, they're they work are, for the purpose. You know? They, they, they are highly purpose. motivated, I can exactly. tell. Um, Michael Reichley, he's the CEO of Innomotics, and you can tell he got a fan crowd. He's a really, really wonderful boss to work for because he delivers inspiration and passion, and that's the commitment. <laughs> so... Staying in the topic here, Innomotics is a 100% Siemens-owned company. It's a business within the Siemens cosmos, and um, it's all about motors and drives, Michael. Please give us a bit more input, what exactly Innomotics stands for, what you're doing, what you're delivering. First of all, Christina, I need to say thank you very much for inviting me. So it's a real Pleasure. honor to represent Innomotics here today and represent the Innomotics team. Are there any Innomotics people in the house? I guess I heard you. Yeah, here we go. Yeah, so it, it's a real honor to be here um, on stage um, and to talk about um, Innomotics. Yes, Innomotics is a 100% daughter company of Siemens, as you said already, self-sustained on its own feet. And we are the market leader in electrical motors and large drives. Mm -hmm. Um, with our 15,000 experts in the world, we are in the meantime running a business that is close to 3.3 billion in revenue, active in the market with a size of 28 billion. And our five divisions, almost all of them are market leaders in their field. So we are very proud to have now the privilege to lead in that market as an own sustained company. And we are clearly in the heritage of 150 years of innovation leadership under the roof of Siemens, mm -hmm. which is known in the market for highest technology, um, know-how for highest quality, for highest reliability. And therefore, with Proud, we do have that purpose that you just um, referred to, redefining reliable motion for a better tomorrow. Which is a wonderful claim. Um, and I want to know what lies behind this claim. Well, redefining stands for innovation leadership. Mm -hmm. Reliable Motion is we are the trusted partner for our customers through the entire life cycle of their operations. And for a better tomorrow means that we have that purpose to make this world better and protect climate with everything we do. Our equipment is relevant for the energy transition to come. Solutions and service business. Um, what do we have in here? What are we delivering there from a no motion side? Well, actually, we are providing different installations to the market that, again, help to um, save um, CO2 emissions. So if you take the entire installation in one year over the lifetime of that equipment, this equipment saves 25 megatons of CO2. I mean, this is amazing. Because of the installation of one year. And if you just imagine the entire CO2 emission, a quarter of that is industrial. Within industrial energy, the electrical energy, 70% of that is electric motors. Electric motors consume that. So just imagine if we would increase one energy efficiency class to the other from IE3 to IE4 or IE4 to IE5, this would mean 10% energy saving for all of these electrical motors. And we are, with our innovation, with our technology, we are pushing for that. The other thing, we have so many motors in the market that are still driven without a, variable speed, without a variable speed drive. So just by using a variable speed drive, you can reduce energy consumption by 50%. Today, 70% of motors are still not driven with a variable speed drive. Other example, we heard a lot about renewable energy. Sometimes it's available, sometimes not. There's the problem of storage. We just recently developed the most powerful electrical motor that was ever built. 
105 megawatts wow. to compress air. So this motor, <laughs> yeah. This motor compresses with highest power air when, it, when energy is available mm -hmm. and releases the air again and generates then power again if the power is needed. So it's a clear renewable energy storage system that we are providing to the market. Wow, very, very, very smart. Any more things where you say this is super special here? Well, usually people tend to ask if there are any, any real life examples. So we brought some real life examples. I like that one in the middle very much because it's a bit a Norwegian customer and Norway is, is the partner country this year of this Hannover fair. So this totally fits with Equinor together. Mm -hmm. uh, we developed a program for Troll 2 and Troll 3 where we did convert um, hydro energies from, from hydroelectrical power plants from 50 to 60 hertz. We connected then the platforms offshore, so from onshore to offshore connection and we did exchange the combustion machines, the gas turbines, by electrical equipment, electrical generators. So just by doing so in these two projects, we can save this 500,000 tons CO2 emission per year. That equals 300,000 cars, and it equals 1% of entire Norway CO2 emission just because of that project. This is amazing. I mean. How long have you been planning and working on this to really say that's the number we're going to go for? Tobias, how long have you been planning for this? Three years? Three years. So three years and now we're in execution and it's doing very, very well. Congratulations. I mean, another project which is on here, that's uh, India Cement, as you can see up there. In India Cement, we have the customer and cement is one of the energy intensest industries yeah. we know about. So we help the customer to reduce energy consumption wherever possible. They have all DC, old DC motors. We exchange the DC motors with a higher voltage induction motor combined with a drive GH100, 180. In that combination, by, re by exchanging, we reduce energy consumption by 80% for that customer. Payback is lower than 24 months. So it's good for nature and it's good for the pocket, the money pocket of our customers. I mean, you're not just talking about 5% numbers. This is like 80%, 70%. This is massive. Big just, time, big it's, time. It's incredible. And, and really. maybe because I, I, I know sometimes I need to be stopped, but we have another third one. <laughs> it's not only installing the, the physical material hardware equipment. It's also providing our customers with respective digital solutions. So with the, the Emirates Global Aluminium customer, mm -hmm. they have a target to reduce their CO2 emissions, greenhouse gas emissions by 10%. We have a long-standing service with them. We did install Inspire IQ, which is a, a cloud-based data platform that makes our drive data available, where you can see humidity, air condition, you can see the voltage, you can see the arcing, and with that, by analyzing these data, increase availability and increase also the efficiency and energy efficiency. So with, with that installation, that customer is saving 70,000 megawatt hours every year. Talking about the future, these are definitely the solution providers. And future ready is a good keyword for me here, um, leading us to the upcoming trends in the global motors business, yeah. which grows fields actually, and emerging market trends do you see ahead of us? Yeah. Well, actually we are in, in two good market areas. On the one hand, we have the traditional markets, which are still very, very active and still growing, like metals processing, like oil and gas, um, like copper miners. Yeah? So we are very much into these markets, but also new ones are going to come up. So on the one hand, hydrogen. So we have the equipment to feed with the respective power the electrolysis systems to generate hydrogen. But we also have the respective compression equipment to actually be installed in the transportation and pipeline system of hydrogen. Mm -hmm. So when hydrogen is going to grow by this 30 plus percent annual market growth, we are in the middle of it. The other one is carbon capture, carbon storage, carbon utilization. Um, we also have the compression machine for that installations. And if the industry wants to reach the net zero target, these carbon capture and storage utilities, they need to be growing by 120 times compared to today. And also our, our equipment um, is in there. 
And then I just talked about this turbine replacements on platforms. Today, I think 2023, there was a study, only 6% of combustion machine and gas turbines are already replaced by electrical machines. It is to be 20% already in 2028 with our equipment again. So th and there's more to come, like, like um, the motor and the drive, so battery production, as well as um, shore to ship connections for ships and harbors. So they don't need to burn oil and gas, mm -hmm. they can use green energy from shore. Perfect. Great, great solutions. <laughs> it's brilliant. And here in Hannover, you do show um, three new products. Tell us more about these. And I think we have a live feed to the Innomotix booth. Can we maybe get this while you already start yeah, talking here. about it? Yeah, here okay. we go. First of all, we as Innomotix team, we are super proud to be with our own booth here at Hannover Fair, this time for the first time. Are you also proud with me? <laughs> That's such a great thing to have this own booth over there. And uh, actually, what you, what you can see here, you see here the IE5 um, permanent magnet motor. So we are launching two new friends in our entire IE5 permanent magnet uh, motor fleet, the 71 shaft height and the 132 shaft heights. We are also then here, you can see some, some kind of the inner life of the active parts of such a motor displayed. We also do release um, our global modular motor platform for the high voltage motors. So here we have a worldwide modular platform with a much better power density in our high voltage motors. That's mm -hmm. also got to be released um, on this Hannover Fair. Here you see that. Okay. That big wow, front. that's yeah. massive. Yeah, yeah right. Okay. So that's actually one part of these installations for compression I just okay. mentioned um, yeah. earlier. And then we are also releasing um, our digital platform Inspire IQ mm -hmm. with the new sensors in the Drive IQ cell installed in our Drive systems and then bringing all that data available for our customers to optimize their operations, which are actually very, very intense and very uh, costly operations. And whenever we can improve their efficiency, it's good for environment and it's also good for the pocket of our customers. So we are very, very happy to be in Omotics, being with our own booth on Hannover Fair 2024. Gonna, one more time to show those and who if are... You, if you just leave the Siemens booth back there at the right upper corner, you can see in Omotics, the Siemens business. We are ready for you all. Please come and visit us. You will see newest technology for motors and drivetrains, and we are happy to receive you. Perfect. And we're happy that you presented that topic, passionate people. It's always good on stage. Thank good you, Michael. Thank you very much. All Thank the best of success. Thank, Thank you. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. All right.